Good morning, students. So today, this will be our first online class. It will be on the topic geometry. Geometry is a branch of mathematics. So in which we deal with the measurement of earth on different dimensions. What we are going to do on geometry <coughs> is we will discuss uh, different shapes, how shapes are formed, the basic elementary topics on this geometry. The first, what we are going to discuss is point. What is a point? This is very small thing, but it's still one of the pillar stone to understand the geometry. What is it? It is simply a dot. This is called point in mathematics, which has no length, no breadth, no nothing, no size at all. It is simply a dot. So, if we have to name it, it will be just suppose. I can call this point as A. Simply just to name it. Is that okay? Now is line. What is line? Line is the collection of such points which can be extended indefinitely or uh, you can say infinitely. It means it is what is line? Line is a collection of points. Well, if I draw this small small points and join continuously, which doesn't end, which you will see actually becomes like this, which can be extended either side. Is that okay? This are one, these are actually the collection of points like this. Is that okay? When this collection of points are extended indefinitely on the right side and also on the left side, this forms a line. Collection of points. So how can we name it? Just to name it, if I mark this as A, certain one point here and another point here is B. So how can I denote it? You can denote it as A, B. Is it okay? There is line A, B. The only thing is what we are going to do, we have to mark it like this. So that is how we denote a line. Is it okay? Now under this is a line segment. What is line segment? Line segment is a part of a line. Is your line? This is a line. A part of only a part. This is BC. Is it okay? Just suppose BC. This is a line. We know it. This much part is the line segment. It means if I remove it, this is a line segment. Is it okay? Which has two endpoints. We still know this, this particular portion. It is a collection of line, a collection of points, sorry, collection of points which is ending on both sides. There is line segment. So, what, I, what we can say? A line Line segment is what? A line which has two endpoints and it is denoted by denoted by 
sonido. Eso no es. Es de lo que. So this has some <coughs> basic uh, with which we are going to do or understand geometry. Is that okay? Now, one more topic is there, that is ray. What is ray? A ray, it has one end point. Is that okay? And one can be extended in This is a ray. Is it okay? What did I say? You can count it as an end point or the starting point. One starting point and This, whatever uh, uh, definition I have written, it is only to understand. Is that okay? Even if you write it like this, so it will be correct only. Uh, but most of the time, uh, you won't see this on book. This is only to understand. So, one is starting point and one goes indefinitely. That is called ray. Is that okay? So, if I suppose give this as A, and this is B. What we can do? It is denoted by A, B. Is that okay? We're going to rub it and continue with the Another topic. Angle. What is angle? When two rays are originate, originates from one particular starting point, then the end inclination between these two rays is called an angle, which can be denoted as the suppose theta. Is that okay? What did I say? Angle is what? One is start, uh, one starting point from which two rays are originating and the inclination between these two hands or arms or the ray is called an angle. Is that okay? Inclination between two Arms originating from a point. Is that okay? So just suppose this is A, this is B, and this is C. This A is on this way, I'm marking one point as A. This is the originating point B, and this is another point on this way. That is C. How do I denote it? Denoted by or denoted as this is the angle or the inclination between these two rays. Right? So, how we are going to write? It means 
we are measuring this angle B. How can I write it? This, like this, angle A, B, C. Is that okay? This is how we can easily draw. We are marking this, we are taking this inclination, that's why we need to keep this is the inclination on what? This is B. I'm keeping this B at the center. A, B, C. That's how we write. We have discussed lines, but what are parallel lines? When two lines never intersect each other, such type of lines are called parallel. Is that okay? It means these two are lines which will never meet each other or never intersect each other. They are always equidistant from each other. Is that okay? So, such type of uh, pairing of lines is called parallel lines. So, lines which never intersects Intersecting lines are what? When two lines intersect each other. Just like this, I can easily mark it. This is C, this is C. This is line AB, CD. Okay, similarly, intersecting lines in this, this is A, just suppose this is B, this is C, this is D. They are intersecting each other at only one point. Just suppose this is D. Sorry. E where they are intersecting each other. Is that okay? Lines which 